Right, now Reds, would you like to come with me and eliminate that little campfire? Because we don't want that just there. And hold on, we need you some more. There's still some more fires. Right, just making sure we're going to get ambushed by... Ah! By these. Come on, minions. Just stand there, you dilly-daddle. Get your weapons ready and bloody kill them! Got so much anger at me, I just need to... I just need to kill something. There's another one. We'll burn him a little bit, see how he likes fire. Not very much, to be honest. I mean, I don't blame him. Fire, after all, is rather dangerous. In the wrong hands. And, of course, my hands are always the wrong hands, so... It's going to be dangerous. Okay, thank you very much, everybody. Got everything you need? Good, let's move on out. Let me ask on that weapon. You can't be fully tall out already, surely. Right, okay, so what were we doing last time? We were getting the, the luggage for Madame Imprisoned, whatever her name was. Did we find out what her name was? Rose! There we go. Retrieve Rose's, Rose's luggage. So to work out, I didn't, did we, I don't remember finding out her name. I'm starting to wonder if we actually did or not. Right, if I get my browns ready, I think I'm going to have to use them soon. Aha! See? Oh. Right, thank you, Tommy. Much appreciated you carrying a little bit of gold all the way for me to get. Mm, very, thank you very much. Right, reds take my browns, so not reds. Take out that very important. Sorry, sir. Didn't mean to kick you. Okay, so what does this do? I can hear something. In fact, those looks like there's a few, a few, r r r r r a few raiders over there. Can we uh, it fell short, sir. It did not work. Oh well. Reds, join the fun. Why not? They're all getting treasure. So that's good. I like it when they get treasure. I feel like I'm doing something wrong when they don't pick it up. So this opens up, and is there a cutscene? Nope, there are just Riverian Raiders. There are just Raiders. They're quite powerful, them Reds, aren't they? They're killing them in two goes. There we go. Good work, Reds. You are an efficient member of the Horde, and you should be commended. Now, can you be further awesome? No, you can't. Because you can't actually see them, and neither can they, which is good. Or bad, depending on how you look at it. Bit of, I think lag's on our side. Lagging out the enemies. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Didn't mean to. Oh. Oh. Nope. Nope. Okay. Oh, what are you firing at? Beetles! Where do the beetles come from? And I don't mean the old birds and the bees. I mean, where did they actually come? Where did they come from? I suppose there's cracks in the walls. They could have come from there. Where's this one? Run! Leave him to me! He's my greatest nemesis. The beetle. You choose all. Right. I did mention, uh, earlier on in the dungeon, you can actually harvest life force from beetles in the dungeon. So we'll be doing that later on. But not just yet. I mean, it's better when you've got a set of piece of equipment. Right. Those raiders don't want me helping the plague victims. They want to create chaos. If that plague gets out of Heaven's Peak, then things will get very disorganised. And I hate that! <laughs> I like organisation. I think you'll be... I think you will find it very nice at the tower. There's a little bit of chaos at the moment because we're renovating, but... Uh, you know, we, we like a bit of organisation. I mean, I'm terrible at that. I <laughs> oh yeah, don't get me started on that. I have... Uh, yeah, I'm just going to leave it there. Organising is a big part of me. Right, okay, now... I'm guessing the luggage is down here. Along with something that's flying underneath fire. Mmm. That creature's presence explains how these raiders entered the castle. Quick, Master! Position your reds on high ground to attack the beast! Right, okay, so now we need to do a bit of uh, organising our horde. So, what we should do. Is now that we've dealt with the little ones on the floor, we'll get the reds, we'll put... You must keep it surrounded! Yeah, sorry, we'll take... Oh, there's a beetle, there's a beetle! Oh no, he's going to attack! 
Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! That's not good at all. I'm gonna die as well. And oh! There we are. Now we have seen. Oh, was it restart or was it return to tower? I think it's return to tower, is it not? Or restart? Restart, I think. Let's try that. Yes, yeah, so there we go. You've seen the dying animation! It's all good! Just like say to her, I think it was Mental Kitty who said, Oh, you're probably not going to die. Yeah. I think I replied to you today saying, We'll see, we'll see. And I think, yeah. We knew it was going to happen. Okay, Reds, I will help you out a little bit. Right, okay, so what did we do wrong? What did we do wrong indeed? Um, in fact, what did we do wrong? What, can, what am I going to do different? Because I think I'm just going to do exactly the same, which is not good. Because what I was going to do is I'm going to put reds there. Oh, do it. We'll get in there. I'll talk while we get in there. Um, I was going to put some reds there. So that. Uh... Yeah, because obviously we had to put the reds there to sort of. So we can aim at it and get it both ways. Because obviously, if you put it on one side, it goes the other way. So I was going to try and put them on there. Both sides, like he said, to do. And leave brown browns there to protect them. But obviously, we died on our way to the other side. So, what am I going to do differently? Because that is the question, because I don't think I'm going to do anything differently, which is not good. Those raiders don't want to be helping before, the plague so victims. To again, just... They want to create chaos. Then again, you probably can't hear me over it, so I'm sorry. Peak, then things will get very disorganised. And I hate that. Me too. Me too. We've established this. Right, okay. So, is it worth getting more reds? I don't think we need more reds. Okay. Yeah, we'll go down here and we'll do that again. Can we skip it? We can't. That creature's presence explains how these raiders entered the castle. Quick, Master! Position your reds on high ground to attack the beast. I've got an idea, he says. You must keep it surrounded. Right, so here is my plan. After we do, I'll just deal with these first. I shouldn't really be going down here. So if I leave all my minions there... Reds, brown, no, I leave this brown here. I mean, to take brown, a red. Yes. No, that's a brown again. Brown. Red. Call back a red. Oh. Right, wait for these to get destroyed. There we go, good. Go, red. Go, red. Go! Now, I'm assuming these guys are going to... Come over to my side, which is not what I want. I want to go to the other That's side. That's it! Now protect them and take it down! Are those other reds not firing? Right, because. Oh no, we lost a minion! It's very slow going. So I would go down there and deal with those. deal with the beetles. Why? Oh, they are firing. Good, it's going to die. Now, bring the luggage to that female creature before she moans the place down. Right, now we just walk away. There we go, and we'll avoid his powerful attack, and we'll continue to lay into him. There we go. Good! Alright, it all worked out in the end. We lost one menu, which I think was a red we will have a look at in a second once I've dealt with this horrible little beetle. Sorry, mister. Sorry, Ringo. I'm sorry, that was terrible. <laughs> Never mind. I sort of paused from it to work out if I was going to do that joke, and I thought, I thought no, but I still went anyway. And I, yeah, yeah it's, it's one of those things. Oh, it was a brown we lost. Who did we lose? Little Tommy is still fine, which is good. Uh, oh, no, it looks like it was Cookie we lost. Oh, dear. Oh, well. It's not worth restarting just to save Cookie. I mean, little Tom, little Tommy. That, was the, that would have been a different matter, but no, nah, alright. May he? That was also what you say. Uh, we're here today to remember our fallen minion, Mr. Cookie. May he be replaced as quickly as possible, and hopefully he lives a happy life. You choose all. Okay, right. Okay, so let's get this. After we have tried, tried, tried to get over Cookie, the loss of Cookie. It's very sad. We will never have a good meal again. Never. But we will still have a cup of tea, which is what I'm going to have now. 
Ah, right. Are they coming? Or are they going the other way? Of course, they're going the other way. Where is everyone else? There's not 14 on there, is it? So where's everyone at? Hold, hold on, hold on. There they are. Why were you down there, gold guys? Silly sods. Let me fill up with the browns. Which can't get on there for some reason. Why can't? What is going on with this game? I think I need to get away from the walls. Right, and again, then we'll go into Peter Rose. Okay, Mistress Rose. If you don't want your skin to rot and drop off, I suggest you find my luggage. Mm, please? No. Oh, at least she has manners. Why are they stuck? What? Ooh. Minions. Why is that one stuck? What is going on here? Right, 12. It's only send 12 over. That's right, isn't it? Okay. And then help them out. Wiggle them around a bit. Wiggle, 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 wiggle it. Come on. There we go. Why is Tommy stuck there? What is up with these bloody minions today? They ain't quite right. Here they come. That's not going to fit. We found a problem. Let's head for spree! My luggage! You and your little cherubs found it. Cherubs? Yuck! I thought you were just the usual run-of-the-mill dungeon fodder, but you've surprised me. I think someone like you could use someone like me. Let's go. Okay, we're leaving. We didn't have a choice. We were leaving anyway. Uh, that's about right, I suppose. Right, okay, so now we've got an organiser. For our tower. Good. Someone to organise things. The minions, they're not so organised, but they need someone to guide them. That's why we've got two people now. Me and Rose. See how we do it. As long as she doesn't drink, and she likes playing games, and likes TV shows, I think we'll be fine. So this is your tower. Hmm. It could use a bit of work. Greetings, mistress. Sire, we've managed to reopen the private quarters. I've instructed the minions to take Milady's luggage there. If you're heading to Heaven's Peak, perhaps you could investigate what's been causing the plague. I'd better get up there. Wouldn't want those little deers eating my things and getting a tummy ache. Give me a chance to spruce up the place a little. Then come on up. I'll put the kettle on. <laughs> Rose has joined you at the tower. Find a source of the plague in Heaven's Peak. She'll put the kettle on. I think I think it's fine. I think it was a match made in Heaven. Speaking of which, Heaven's Peak's just unlocked. So there we go, the tower. It's now been it's now been a sort of not rebuilt, but it's 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 now uh, it's at its basic level where it's rescuer of the distressed damsel. Yes, it's now at its basic form where you can start to you know make it a house Leader of, home. of the fire starters. Yeah, it's more of a home than rather a cave, which is always a bad benefit. Of Melvin Underbelly. Okay, so dungeon is a no. Do we need to go downstairs? We do not. Steel. We are wheel of steel. We don't need to go down the forge, although we have got Merciful the winner of the pole. We have that one already, Do we go down there, actually? How much? How many minions have we got? Be quiet. Whoa, 55. That's not right. Oh, no, it might be right, actually. That might be right because I think I might have killed some. Yeah, alright, so we don't need to go down to the forge, so shall we go up to the uh, private quarters? I think we've given her enough time to put the kettle on. Coming, Rose! Let's see what the private quarters are like. Ah, there you are. This place isn't what I'm normally used to, but one has to make the best of things, I suppose. Let me show you around. Not much to look at here, but nothing that a really good dust wouldn't cure. We'll have to find a maid. Or slaves, one or the other. Now this could be a great space. A bedroom, a banqueting area, even your own private interrogation room. Yes, and I think this tour is broken because she wasn't talking about this bit here. She's talking about another room which we'll talk about in a minute. We'll just finish the look around first. Alright, what's down here, Rose? <gasps> I think that this area would make an adorable treasure vault. I think the lighting would set off your riches wonderfully. You do have riches, don't you? Meh. Not many. It'll, it'll get more, though. Ooh, what's this room? Now this is the nerve centre of your evil domain. 
I've created a scale model of your tower out of bits and bobs I found lying around. I'm very resourceful. Another trait we like. Ooh, this is like my little personal office, I guess. Right. There's our little miniature tower. Oh, I do love it. It's amazing, isn't it? Right, okay. Customise your dark tower. Alright then. And you can see this is where the customization comes into play. Let's have a little look, shall we? Oh, Rose doesn't actually say anything. Okay, so let's have a look at what we can do. Uh, so we've got some banners. So we've got the Minion Banner, the Overlord Banner, the Triumph Banner, the Evil Eye Banner. And that's about it. Uh, we've got spikes at the bottom of the tower. Crown Top, which has disappeared. I don't know where it is. Fireballs by your tr throne. Red Carpet. Very nice. Imperial Throne. <laughs> oh, that's quite menacing. Uh, Guardian Statues and the Chimera. Statues or Chimera? I think it's Chimera. Chimera. Don't know. Right, okay. Um, do we buy anything? I don't know. I mean, I want to. I mean, <laughs> some, I mean, these three things here, and probably the red carpet as well. I mean, they're all lovely. I wouldn't mind having a few of them. I, mean, uh, I don't know if we can spare the money at the moment. Maybe if we get a flag. Right, but which one? I quite like the Overlord one. It's quite organised, and if we're going for the Imperial Throne as well, it might suit it. We'll, we'll just buy this for now, and then we'll leave it. Okay, then. Purchase. Ah, just what we need. Because, of course, we are the ones in charge. Okay. Huh. Anything else, Rose? Do you want to say anything else? Hmm. I'm assuming not. Right, okay. So here's our overlording library. This is where we keep all of our evil tomes. And uh, fables, evil fables in the books and stuff. Uh, we've got roses, because obviously she's called Rose. So I'm guessing she likes the rose. I think that this area would make an adorable yeah. treasure vault. I think the lighting would set off your riches wonderfully. You do have riches, don't you? Not as much as I'd hope to. It does overfill, which is good when we get enough, but we're not yet. Okay, now if we go round here... And we'll have a look at... So this is the room where she was talking about the interrogation room or banquet hall or something like that. Uh, it's nothing at the moment, but it will change later on. And I don't think I've seen it uh, as Rose, of what we get from Rose. I've seen it what you get from uh, something else, but... Uh, hmm, not sure. And this is the bed chamber. Sleeping quarters, as it were. So we've got a little bed there. And I don't know where Rose's luggage is. I'm guessing she put it all away, but it would be nice to sort of see it affect the tower. Which I suppose it has, hasn't it? Maybe it was just full of Rose beds and like Rose buds and she just grew them from the cuttings. Okay then, Rose, well, thank you for the lovely tour of the private quarters. It was wonderful as always. Uh, so we'll go downstairs and carry on with the rest of our lives. Cautious Crusader! Yeah! Cautious Crusader? What the hell? What's that one? of the Dark Tower. I don't know what that one is. And she's not here. I thought... Rescuer of the Distressed Yes, damsel. I thought the Distressed Damsel was going to be down here, but she's clearly not. Right, okay, then, but that's that done. Uh, so, we're right. So let's have a look at our list of things to do. Find the source of the Pagan Heavens. People won't do that just yet. Find entrance to Heavens. People won't do that just yet. Discover what's luring your presence away. We won't do just yet. Seek the entrance to the Elven Forest. We won't do that just yet, either. Let's have a look at the history. I'm not going to read some of that, uh, but we can see what we've done. In case you're interested. I know some people like to read these things. Uh, sometimes you get a bit of information from it. Alright, but I think... Leader of the fire starters. Twisted fire starters. Yeah, I think uh, we should leave that now. We'll go back to Mellow Hills. Or is there any reason to go to Mellow Hills? Uh, yeah, I think yeah, I think we do, because I'm not going to go to Heaven's Peak just yet. I think I'm going to go to a different area first, because obviously there's different areas. Uh, we've had sort of like the halfling area, which is spree and everything. Uh, so now we'll go to... There's two other places we can go to, because now we have the reds, we can get past into that elven forest. Evernight forest, it's called. Uh, or we can go to Heaven's Peak, obviously, that we know already. And I think we're going to make a start on the elven forest. I usually go there first. I think I'm going to go there now. So, yeah, might as well. Right, five of the finest reds, ten of the brownest of browns, and that is good. We'll leave the life force for now. We'll, we'll build it up when we need to build it up, which is when we get a certain amount of equipment. But I think... Is there anything else we need to do? I think we've... Oh, I know what we need to do. We need to go this way where the halfling party was, because I remembered that we needed to get uh, a bag of gold. 
So we'll go and get that now. Over the bridge we go to the gold. Come on, minions. Sing a merry tune. <laughs> 